Hello everybody and welcome to On The Spot STEM. Today we will be tackling num problem number 18 from the AMC 10A of 2019. So in this problem it states how for some positive integer k, the repeating base k representation of the fraction 7 over 51 is 0.23 repeating. And they want us to find k. So to start off, let us set some value x equal to 0 0.23 repeating. And we want to figure out x in terms of base 10, so we can set it equal to 7 over 51 in the end. Now, remember when we were converting decimals from repeating decimals into base 10 fractions? Let's say we had the value 0 0.35 repeating in base 10. What we would do is we'd multiply by 100, so we get 35.35 repeating equals 100x. And then we know that 35.35 repeating, if this equals x, 35.35 repeating is 35 plus x equals 100x. And then from here, we would be able to subtract x on both sides and get how x is equal to 35 over 99. So a similar approach can work in this case, except instead of multiplying by 100, as we did in here because we were in base 10, we multiply by k squared because that's how we can, we can shift over the decimal places two spots to the right. So if we do this, we get k squared times x equals 23, 0.23 repeating in base k. We know that this is going to be equal to 23 plus x. However, there is a catch here. We might be tempted to say 23 in base 10 because that's what we're used to, but this is actually 23 in base k. So what is 23 in base k? Well, that would be 2 k's and then 3 1's. So we know that k squared x is going to be equal to 2k plus 3 plus x. And now we can actually get x alone, which is what we wanted to find, in a base 10 number. And we get that x is going to be equal to 2k plus 3 over k squared minus 1. And now we need to figure out what when this fraction 2k plus 3 over k squared minus 1 we want to figure out when this is going to be equal to 7 over 51. Now obviously if we're running out of time on the actual AMC 10 we could plug in the answer choices and see which one works but a more rigorous solution is when we multiply, we use cross products to get the quadratic and solve the quadratic. So we know that 7k squared minus 7 equals 102k plus 153. So 7k squared minus 102k minus 160 equals zero. So now we need to solve this quadratic. We want to figure out what two factors multiply to 7 times negative 160 and add up to negative 102. And this ends up being negative 112 and 10. So we do 7k squared plus 10k minus 112k minus 160 equals 0. And from here we can factor out and get 7k plus 10 times k minus 16 equals 0. And from here we can tell that k would be equal to negative 10 over 7 or 16. However, a base cannot be equal to a fraction, let alone a negative number. So we know that k must be equal to 16. So looking at our answer choices, we see that 16 is one of our answer choices, and we get D as our answer.